down a little bit. See? Oh shit. We could have gone back the whole time, people. See, this is why it's no good to always have Neb in charge of the navigation. Kiwi, you did say to go back. It's true. Um, we did not think that we could go back, and we're sorry. Neb's sorry. Or, <laughs> or maybe... He's very we, sorry. We knew we could go back, and we just didn't despite he's, you. He's really maybe sorry. Maybe that's what happened. He admits his error <laughs> comfortably and easily. <laughs> Welcome everyone. We are going to play Secret Order Five: The Red Kingdom. I'm here with Steph. Um, I think last time we beat the game actually, but we're doing like the bonus chapter. Is we are about right? to start the bonus chapter. That is correct. So we don't even have to remember any of the story. Excellent. What are our animal facts that we learned today? <sighs> what are the animal facts that we learned today? Um, whales are smart enough to put like dead fish near the shore to attract birds so that they can eat the bird. Correct. I saw footage of that happening. An orca whale specifically. Orca whales. We okay. also learned that Amazon river dolphins, which are called bodos, okay. do not have a sense of smell, which makes them very vulnerable to pollution. To me that's fascinating. Did you know that there were dolphins that didn't have a sense of smell? I mean, I'd never really thought about it, but like... I guess I, if... If there was a true or false question, like, you know, make a guess. Do you think all dolphins have a sense of smell? I'd say, yeah, probably. Right? So right. this is a surprising animal fact. Although, if you saw a yes or no question that said, do you think dolphins are real? What would you have said? They're probably <laughs> as real as a reindeer. Okay. Which is to say fake. Okay. Right? Excellent. Like only in movies. Okay. So when you talk about there being five species of animals. Dolphin it's... might be one of them. Reindeer. Well, reindeer slash dolphin. Reindeer. It's the group of mythical animals. <laughs> Alright, mythical animals. Is one type. Cats. Yeah. Wait, we have to save Julie, why? Uh, she threw dynamite at something. She did. And now we have to save Julie. What is going- I feel like was, maybe we do need to re remember. Julie- uh, Julie was her friend. Yes. And her friend was being taken away by that yeah, evil she was man. Like, yeah, and then like she was locked up near the dragon for, right. and the kid. Mm -hmm. For like, basically the whole game, right? And like, and we did, we went to like a dream world or something like that. So I, by the time we got the end, I completely forgot about Julie. I don't know either, but I see an egg, and I feel like we should get it. Where do you see the egg? I don't see the egg. It's in the center of the screen. Oh no, Julie's on the other side. Okay. Apparently, that's not an egg. Maybe it is an egg, but we need to. The spear that gives the habitat energy is damaged. Sarah, I'm stuck here, but you should go and make sure there's no water leaking in. If there is, you have to stop it before you can help me get inside. Oh, right, because we're underwater, right? Like, this, it's an underwater city. And look, there is... Oh, wait, it's a lava egg one. I was about to say, I thought that's a purple egg. Right. You know how we did not find all the purple eggs? Right. I was going to say, some of the hidden objects are right. in the bonus center, but I think it's its own set of... It, it might just be seven lava eggs. Yeah. So, yeah, right at the beginning of the game... Okay. We went to our father's. We went to somebody's house. I don't remember. And like the guy, yes. maybe it's Julie's house. The guy burnt down the house. It was Julie's house. Kidnapped Julie. Right. Then we like convinced a drunk seller to let us borrow his boat or something. We did. And then maybe. we dived underwater. And this whole city was underwater. And it's... then we went to a dream world where we met the Native American guy who I thought was the same Native American guy as, as the previous game. Sure. So is this like slightly before the end of five? Because we save Julie in five, or is this after the end? We're in five. Yeah, but I'm saying the bonus chapter, like uh, oh. the main, the main chapter of five ended with us saving Julie. But did but we now really she... save her? Maybe we didn't save her. Well, we what did we do? We we, we, we there won. was a dragon. We won. <laughs> yeah, no, but like we, we released the dragon, the right? Dragon, but, and but then, maybe and then he she killed. still got, or maybe she got saved, but now she's trapped over there. Because she threw some dynamite on the floor, which blew, I guess, this yeah. or something, and now it collapsed. Okay, but so from but her she own got stupidity, stuck on the other side. She got right. stuck because she, she messed around dynamite. She should have done better demolition. Don't touch the de Why are we de demolishing anything? Why don't we just leave and go home? All right. Do you so, want to start playing from the beginning so that we know <laughs> <laughs> why? I got this thing. Great. I really want to know what's behind this thing. I, I really do. What is what is behind it? Follow this dragon. We have to find another way out. That's a heavy counterweight. I don't know what that is. 
Like a spike? The chain is not attached yet. It looks attached to me. Put the nail in there. It isn't stable enough. Oh, because there's a nail here, and then, like, this right. whole thing can come off, I guess? Yeah. I thought the only... I thought this was, like, a rock, and then this would unhook or something like that. Oh. But it's saying, like, this whole thing is loose. Like, it's a butterfly thing. Looks like I need a special tool to open this lamp. Sure. I have to get there somehow. What if we send our hammer. little dragon? Oh. Nope. I think I'm supposed to use the rock as a hammer. Okay. Now I can cross, maybe? Looks like a piece is missing. Now we get to do some hidden objects. Excellent. Julie can wait. Dragon skull plate. I think it's those little, yeah, those things. Those little scarab beetles. There's one on the bird cage. I must be really thinking about the skull. Okay. <laughs> so I have 10. I was hoping it was, I was scared as like you got 10 left to find. Oh. I like that would suck because I felt like I found a lot more. Kiwi, hey, how's it going? Hey, Kiwi. We're looking for dragon skull plates. We're um, playing the bonus chapter of Secret Order 5. Right. Julie, I don't even know if you if you were <laughs> Julie's like our friend or something like that. She um the plot is not important. She's stuck now, and we have to help her. Yeah. How about using that knife or something? You immediately go oh. to the knife, huh? Yeah, I do. I do. Why do I have this? Because this is missing something, so <laughs> right. surely it must be this. Kiwi, how's your love life going? What the heck? Whoa. I don't even know. Oh, okay. I think I understand. It's matching. Your love life. How's your love life? Same old, says Kiwi. Well, could be worse. Got, what is this, a toy soldier or something like that? Bronze figure. And the scarf. And the necklace? Or more rope? More rope, I think. String. String. <laughs> Can't quite reach it. Do you see the egg? I don't see the egg. It's in front of that giant crystal. The one giant crystal in this whole room, right? Um, no. Is that this? It's the one with the egg in front of it. Flag piece. Kiwi, oh, we're looking piece. for these lava eggs. We found, um, there's lava eggs in the bonus chapter, which is not always the case in bonus chapters. And there's seven of them, and I guess we found two now. There must be a way to attach these two. Maybe we need a needle. It's so windy outside. I wonder what's up there. Is that we a needle? found a needle. Perfect. I could probably sew this if I had some thread. Wow. This person sews a lot faster than I do. Kagero, hi, Nebu. Hi, Kagero, how's it going? Why do I want this? I have a flag? Oh, it's windy outside, so I gotta do something with the flag in the wind? Why Attach do I... it to the chain, maybe? Put this chain here? Yeah. I saw a chain like that needs a lot of power to move it. For example, the wind power, right? Yes. I guess it must be very, very windy if, if that's enough to, like, raise or lower this staircase. Well, here's another hidden object. Puzzle. Watering can. Right in the center. Oh, yeah, like a plant watering can. I was thinking a gasoline can, I guess. Mm. Rhinestone. 
this right thing. there. Yep. Compass. Circle or, or north. north. It's north. And it's to the uh, east. east. <laughs> to the which west. Is which way? This to the west. <laughs> Wait, no, that was buckle crap. Yeah, it's right there. I meant I got the wrong thing. Lantern. Pulley. This? Yeah. Roses. Yep. You see the oh, spider? I see a spider. I don't want to touch the spider. Okay. Why would anyone want to touch a spider? You don't like any part of nature. There's a dancing rope here. <laughs> It's um, hanging off of that um, outboard motor looking thing, or I'm not even sure what that is. Part of the ductwork. A little bit to your right. Yeah. Outboard motor. Duct, okay. Clip. Like a video clip? Probably not. Probably like that clothespin. Yeah. Goblet of wine. Well, here's. Here's the um the wine. Is this for the goblet? Yeah, that could be a goblet. Spyglass. Well, we got this, but it needs. It, oh, it must be a case for a telescope. Retro hour. Hello, everyone. Hey, retro. How's it going? I think there's little pieces of it. Like for example, this yeah, piece. that one. And this piece. Oh, well, two pieces. <laughs> and now we need the abstract concept of six. Well, there's a five near the spider. Ah. So we, mm, we scrape need, like, away the moss. Scrape away the moss. You're right. Here's the abstract concept of six. <laughs> Grindstone is a useful object we found. Okay. Excellent. What's up? We are. What are we trying to do? We're trying to help Julie, like, like ostensibly. Right. <laughs> but, but in fact, we are walking around picking up junk. Grabbing objects. This there... chest is way too heavy for me to push unless I grease up the floor. <laughs> sure. There's a egg. Um, oh yeah, we're also looking for lava eggs. To the left of the opening there. Here, this yes. is a lava egg. So if you guys see lava eggs, shout it out loud, and then type in the chat. <laughs> right. If this structure moves up. I could check out the next level. What structure? This or this whole floor? What what structure is moving Maybe up? Maybe the stairs. Well, I can go to the floodgate entrance. Oh right, we're looking for a leak. That's what Julia said. She said make sure the water isn't leaking because we're in an underwater city or something like that. We think we might be. We don't really know I, the plot. I'm pretty sure so well. we were. Like I remember going. Yeah, here's a diving suit. I'm pretty sure this whole. City is underwater. I don't know what these things are, but I'll take them. There's an egg on the shelf when you back out. Did everybody shout? Everybody, everybody shouted. Shout out. Love Yay! Egg, go. Good job, Kiwi! <laughs> Good shouting. Great. This giant door is stuck. Oh, there's Julie. Hi, Julie. I've got to find a way to reach her. So drop the grinds on her head. <laughs> don't think that's it. That's not how you reach her? I don't think that's this right. This cover is pretty massive. What is this? Allen key. Puzzle piece. Diving suit. Belt. I thought it's a bell, but it says belt. Diving cylinder is okay. Can't look at the... What do we call this? Barrel? Yeah, can't look at the barrel. I was gonna say bucket, but it's not a bucket. Why, why am I still able to look at this? This center of this machine is missing. Is this the center of the machine? It is. A stone like this could sharpen even the dullest blade. I'll have to try something else. Get Julie with, with the Van Halen... Van Halen? Van Halen maneuver? Jump? Um... Maybe. <laughs> That's the guitarist, right? No, it's the name of one of their songs. But that'd be cool if the guitarist's name was Jump. <laughs> Wait, what? Van Halen is the name of a guitarist. Oh, yes, but it's also the name of a band that was formed by Eddie Van Halen. Yeah, maybe that's the guitarist I'm thinking of. <laughs> <laughs> Pro probably. You, you think a lot about guitarists, so it's hard to know which one you have in mind. But the alternative interpretation, because I was like, is he talking about a guitarist? Or he might have been talking about uh, a maneuver in Metal Gear Solid. But I don't think it was Van Halen, I think it was something else. 
<laughs> like the Heimlich. Something maneuver. like that. Yeah, like, but it's it's an extraction maneuver for being airlifted out by a hot air balloon. Kiwi wants to know what the green thing is that we have in it our inventory. It is a inventory. puzzle piece. So you see puzzles, shout, and then type. Allen key. I mean. I don't know what any like I, I assume all of this diving stuff is that when we ultimately get out of here. We can dive. Yeah, we can undive, because we're already divin. Can we use the Allen key on that? We're doved. On that? No. Wait, we're doved? Yeah. Mm. This whole city is underwater. We've divin. So we have to undive. You know how under the stairs there's water? Um I can't go down <laughs> anymore. <laughs> Under the stair. Are you talking about the, the the circular stairs or? I don't remember there being water under any stairs. Oh, he thinks that we'll eventually need the diving gear there. I think we're gonna need the diving gear when we go. Up. You can dance if you want to. You can leave your friends behind. That's a reference to the safety dance. Yeah. Use a diving gear on the stairs. Okay. I'm assuming these are the stairs they're talking about, but I don't think there's water underneath these stairs. I think we need to go up. Well, uh, try using if only the, we move the structure. Uh, try up. using the key on there. The Allen key. Yeah. So we need grease for that. Right. This is like I think everything here is like this whole floor is this interaction point. Okay. Or maybe it's supposed to be this stairs plus I don't know if the, she's talking about this thing, like this giant motor, or she's talking about the stairs, because the interaction point overlaps both. Kiwi is suggesting that we go back. I don't think we can go where he wants. We can only go to these two rooms right now, right? Yeah. Um, and I can sharpen something. But we don't but know not my what. Wit. <laughs> I, I want to... Okay, we need to... We definitely need to get something to sharpen, because we need to cut this, right? Right. So, so what can we grab? And then sharpen. Try different ways of putting the Allen key in. Like maybe put the Allen key down to that that secondary part. Yeah, there. So it has to like get lit before we can do something. And the only lighting place is up here. Okay. How about that um, block? Can we get it? What block? Go back into that screen. There's like a block of wood there. Do you see it? Okay. Can we open any of those drawers? No. Back to where the window is. Okay. This is what Kiwi says. Can you go? Can you go back to where the window is? So here we are with the window, but I don't see an interaction point except for the heavy claw. Or cover, right, and it, there's that thing that looks like a, a hinge. Yeah. And it looks like we should be able to use the key on that. But, you but can't. nothing happens, which is irritating because it looks like you ought to be able to in some way. Wait, does the dragon have teeth? Is the dragon super strong? Can the dragon be sharpened? The dragon cannot be sharpened. I'm just thinking of all the things we didn't try. Like, when, whenever we went somewhere and we tried everything, we didn't try the dragon. It's true. Are we missing an interaction point somewhere? Is the barrel interactable? I do not believe so. I mean, it highlights, but it actually takes you to the cloth. Like, there's clearly something back here. If I could just, you know, reach around and grab it. Are you sure you can't go back a screen? I assume you mean down the stairs. I do not... Here to be capable of going down these stairs. So that thing in the back, that right there, could theoretically have grease in it in some way? Yes. So is there anything we can use on that? I feel like I use every object. Okay. For this. I don't, I don't even know if this thing is the interaction point because it says the same thing for this and the stairs. So it could be, oops, that one didn't actually trigger. So it could be that this is actually, like it, they meant for it to be the stairs, but they just drew the bounding box too far. Mm -hmm. Can you fast travel with a map on the stairs? Maybe, but I feel like that's cheating. So I want to do that as a last resort. 
Like, sorry, let me rephrase it. I feel like using the map is cheating because using the map reveals where the next action is, which is like a hint. And if we are like in a bug state where, you know, we were supposed to be able to go back, but we should not have been, uh, but, like we were supposed to be able to go back, but like the game's bug, then yeah, I feel like we probably have to use a map to unbug the game. But that's why I want to do that as a last resort after I've tried everything, because unfortunately, the map is going to tell us where we need to go next. We can use the belt to reach you. The diving suit belt? I, I don't... Is this glass? I assumed I, it was a glass window. Can you smash the glass? The glass isn't even an act, interaction it point. Seem, it's just Julie yeah. is the interaction point. Guys, we're like, what, five minutes in and we're already, oops, I almost clicked hint, I meant to click dragon, and we're already stumped. What about this stupid thing? You know how we need to like charge it before we use it, but we, mm -hmm. can, we never... There must be a better way. Where would you keep grease? Unless that's like a red herring and you're not supposed to use grease at all. But the game wouldn't do that, right? It wouldn't be that. When cool. you did that, can you go. Um, can you point the cursor towards us? I point the cursor. Like as if you were gonna go back up? Like. Yeah, down a little bit. See? Oh shit. We could have gone back the whole time, people. See, this is why it's no good to always have Neb in charge of the navigation. Is this grease? Thank goodness we have the special key. Kiwi, you did say to go back. It's true. Um, we did not think that we could go back, and we're sorry. Neb's sorry. Or, <laughs> or maybe... He's very we, sorry. We knew we could go back, and we just didn't despite he's, you. He's really maybe sorry. Maybe that's what happened. He admits his error <laughs> comfortably and easily. <laughs> Valley Ranch include a very IKEA purchase. That's true. That's the best part of purchasing things from IKEA. You get to add to your Allen Ranch what am I doing? Allen Allen Ranch collection. What is this? Am I clicking? Am I? You're putting those pieces into that puzzle. Can I rotate? Yes, I can. Yes. Okay, there we go. Now it's making sense. Because before it was making about as much sense as. <laughs> Kiwi's requests to go back. Yeah, as in it's like perfect I, I already sense, told you, but I can't go back. <laughs> We've established that as an axiom. Right. We've tested it. <laughs> We've confirmed. You don't test axioms. You just assume they're true. You just assume. Yeah. Excellent. That's how it works. What's going on here? What? What? If only I could get rid of that cell, the chain would move. Back. But I just built that cell. Why would I want to get rid of it? To get rid of it. Can we send the dragon down there? Oh wow. Wait, no! <laughs> I did <laughs> Okay. Now for sure we can't go back. <laughs> you may want to test that first, but you're in. <laughs> Alright, we are gonna go forward from here, group. <laughs> There is a dragon egg to the far left. But also we broke the thing. Wow, I'm lucky nothing hit me. It's true. It's like a bizarre staring contest. Hey, look at that. You saw the elusive object here? <gasps> oh my god, elusive objects. Morphing object, that's it called. So there are some in this, like, in the bonus chapter. Great. I Wait, where's the been looking egg? At oh, them. it's over here. It moved. That's weird. See, you didn't find... There was, you were wrong, there was no egg there, but I found an egg! <laughs> what?! I found an no. egg over here! No! <laughs> That's what happened. I have to complete this stanchion? That's- that's a- that's a word. Stanchion. What is a stanchion? It's that thing. I can't oh. believe I missed the bizarre staring contest pun. <laughs> I was too busy looking for eggs and I missed it. 
Oh, this is the thing where she said make sure it's not leaking. I just saw a loose watch here. Morphing object, sorry. Do you see the egg? No. Because sometimes you find the eggs. Yeah. And I don't. But I it's found in the an egg now. Work. Oh, I, good job. I, you didn't find the egg, but I found an I egg. I see. I see. <laughs> Excellent. I can't take a look around unless I stop the leak. A stanchion, if you were wondering, is a sturdy, upright fixture that provides support for some other object. It can be a permanent fixture. You didn't know that. I you, you just found just out now. I just told you. I you just, just found out now you because Kegaro posted the definition. What? You You're, didn't know what that was. I can't means. read that screen from here. Oh, yeah. Were you an English teacher before? English major. I was not an English teacher. Okay. I taught psychology classes. Okay. Are they? Is that where you're getting... No. No? Maybe. Last night... I, I did. I streamed last night okay. without you. What? And Kagero was asked... He said Wait, something you after, have viewers who watch you even Kagero during was my time? Kagero viewer. Oh, okay. All right. I think he was there also. But anyway, <laughs> Kagero <laughs> asked... Um, geez, I, I can't remember what he asked. Or maybe he didn't ask me. He just said something. But he said something and then I was like, oh yeah, I think... Um, Steph used to be an English teacher. And another time when you were 100%... I was 99% right. Right. All right. Okay, great. I was never an English teacher. I thought you said something like some student would talk and then and like they don't contribute anything meaningful, but they felt like they still had to express their opinion anyway. Even though they had nothing interesting to say. Sure. Something like that. That doesn't just happen in English classes. I don't know if you knew that from your experience. I've only ever have, had that happen in, in English, English classes classes that see, I taught. That's why that's probably yeah. what happened, right? That did happen in my psychology classes. Oh god, oh, we made no. it worse. <laughs> yeah, this is it. this is it. He told me that Yellowwood Robert Frost puzzles gave me consternation. Do Yellowwood Robert Frost puzzles give you consternation? I don't know what a Yellowwood Robert Frost puzzle is. I know I'm, the only like I'm like I don't know what that is. I, well, what I do know is Robert Frost, the path not taken. Right. That's all I know. I don't know what Yellowwood is, and so I don't know the rest of the reference. I see. We know it flares, as in the breakdance move. I think those little green shotgun, shotgun shells. shells. <laughs> <laughs> um. Wait, this isn't one? I've been clicking this like five times. See, you you were remembering the correct Oops. poem. Oh no, close your eyes, don't look. All right. Kagero is there's... pointing out that you were remembering the right poem. Oh, there, there's a yellow wood in that poem. <laughs> Two roads diverge in the yellow wood, and sorry I could not have traveled both and be one traveler. Long as I stood and looked down one as far as I could to where it bent in the other grove. It doesn't even rhyme. How is that a poem? <laughs> You clearly taught some English classes. <laughs> Where people contributed nothing useful. <laughs> I think you could probably use that broom to clear the spider web. If only I could pick it up. Oh. Alright. But I can use this. <laughs> nope. Probably the bag is one. Where? There we go. Look at this mouse. I should use the knife on him. What's this? You oh, should not duster? use. Why are you threatening to kill no, mice? No, pet him gently with a m with knife. A, <laughs> yeah, with the blunt, no, side, like the side. No, not the edge. No. Okay, now they got these shotgun shells. Time to fix this window. Wow, we have a lot of items in our inventory. Point being that I frittered over either or choices. That was his point. That was Kagura's point the whole time. It's a pretty good point. I don't think I did though. Or maybe I think. Not hmm. to put too fine I... a point on it. That's a pretty good point. How do I not... How do I make the glass? Use the glove. The glove? I can't look around <laughs> until I stop the leak. Fair enough. Ring parts. Ring part, what the heck? I feel like... Can I actually look around though? Even though I didn't stop the leak? It looks like I can, I can look around. The spike. What they said. This must be the soul of the habitat down here. I love the power glove, it's so bad. That's clearly a direct quote from something. But from I... Robert Frost. <laughs> I don't think I can go back down. Confirm for. Oh no, I can. This looks so weird. Like, look at. Like, it's not here. It's right. like, go here where there's a solid right. floor. Right. But we have learned our lesson. 
point at the, the edge of the screen, not where the... I mean, except for this one. Here, I gotta go here. I, I can't... Can I go here? No. I, yeah, I have to go here to go to the left. Is a problem that I just need a better grip? No. How about the flare? What do I do with a flare? I don't, like, kind of... I want the knife so I can cut this thing. The knife's gonna be dull and we're gonna have to sharpen it. Yeah. So I should have brought it with me. But instead I use on the mouse. <laughs> I think you've learned an important lesson. Oh, what's this? Crowbar? What is that? Broken duct. Why do I want that? Try putting I it in the hole. I wonder what's hidden in this barrel. What hole? This? Yeah. I feel like that's going to make things a lot worse. How do I find what's in, in the barrel? Can I sharpen the rope attack? Oh, maybe. Oh, where'd that gem come from? <laughs> what the heck game? That's cheating. That means I have to re-examine every spot in case something new spawns somewhere. I guess there's no going- See, the game confirmed it. <laughs> oh, wait. We can look at this. Try the broken duct. Oh man. Oh, we probably need this thing, right? To make them look symmetric. Oh, symmetry. I see. And probably those weird gems. That's probably what they're for. Yeah. This. Oh no, it's just glowing. I was gonna say I know. Just... The other one glows sometimes too. What's up with those candles? What candles? You see they're sort of candles oh, on yeah, the air. Yeah. Well, sometimes you need a light source. Okay. okay this, does this guy have a secret ability to seal glass? Or burn down barrels? Try... Maybe over... Like adding the broken duct to various places? To a substational contribution. Substa state. Substantial. Are we doing stanchion jokes? Stanchion. Oh. What if you try? No. Situation. <laughs> Substantial. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm struggling to make it work. Sorry. My delivery. Why do I want a flare? Why do I want any of these things? I don't even know what a stanchion is. Can you put the broken duct in the um in the? Oh, like a yeah. crowbar. So this is literally a crowbar. I thought this game names things after what you can use them for, not what they actually are. Wait, I think I saw something. Here. This is a checklist. Put on your suit. Oh, that um, must be complete. Is there a place I can set? Oh, it must be here. That's where I set up. Get rid of all this junk so I don't have to carry it around with me. What the heck is this? It's the other clock piece. Why do I have two clock pieces? They're gauges. gauges. What's this? <laughs> A gauge? The gate has to be fixed before oh. it close. Oh, the one that we wrecked open with our broken valve? Plausibly. Why do I have two gauges? Oops. And then what? To fix the gauges? The pressure should be stabilized. 
So what I'm hearing is we're just going to leave um, Julie. Maybe we're going to go fix the leak from the outside? So what's the problem? It's just this guy? Like, being not red is good, or being wiggly, or being blue is good, or...? I think being not red is good. Where is this guy receiving pressure from? From th these three places? Yes. But that only adds up to 40, right? It's saying 60 here. 5 plus 15, that's 20. Plus 20, that makes 40. Maybe also the bottom one? It is game from this one, but... Is it game from this one then? No, it's not game from this one. Oh, okay. It's game from that one. It's game from that one. Wait, what? It's not additive. Or is it? Oh, it is, because it went down by 5 because it put this here. I don't understand how to do this puzzle, though, because this guy is affected by three, three of them, right? And the three lowers is 5, 15, and 20. We have two 20s. So how, did, how the heck could you lower this guy? Unless the goal is to make them all red, right? Because getting them below, getting this guy any lower is impossible, it seems. Wait, or it doesn't even have to be low? It just has to be not 60? Because now this guy's calm, right? Right. So if I just make this guy not succeed, is that going to solve it? Well, they're all not 60 now. But it, I guess it's not solved. Good job not solving it. It's like an M.C. Escher painting. Yeah, kind of. Can you flip those handles? I tried. Okay. So it's not sufficient for them to all not be the red number, which is 60 for all of them. I think it's impossible. No, it's like the numbers are changing. So I'm like, can you, there's a number down here, right? Which is yes. the value showing, and then there's there's a red number on each of them. And when it was equal to the red number, they were freaking out. I'll try to show that. Except I can't show that now. Yeah, this guy's freaking out, right? Because it's because he's equal to that number, and so is this guy. Okay. So when they're equal to the red number, they freak out. So I say, okay, so maybe I want them to not be equal to the red number, but that's not sufficient because now they're not equal to the red number, but the puzzle's still not solved. So the other theory is maybe it has to be below the red number. Like usually gauges are such that you know the red number is the max, and anything above it, equal or above, is bad. But it looks like it's impossible to get this guy below 60 because he's affected by three of the numbers. Wait, these numbers don't even add up to to 60. Like, yeah, they all add up to this, 60 together. But what I mean but is, they don't add up to 65. Yeah, but I mean, this is it's 20 plus 20, so that's 40 plus 5, 45. So that's 45, and now this guy says 65. So it's not even, they're not even adding up. Are you pressurizing or depressurizing? I don't know. Why don't you read the instruction? Because that's for losers. That's for beginners. People who are bad at games read the instructions. People who are manly man, they just do it. So why don't you just read the instructions okay, then, fine, based fine. on that? Yeah. Equalize the pressure by swapping the tokens. Each token and tank. What? Each token and tank have a certain value that affects the value of the connecting tank. 
the sum of each side needs to be 60 units. So they need to all be 60. Okay. That's my interpretation of that. But they all have some sort of their own scale? Or so like when that? they freak out, it's good, I guess. Okay. Um... So that one needs to be 20, I think, instead of 15. Yeah. There we go. I could have probably figured it out. <laughs> yes, that would have been very exciting for our viewers. I, mean, I want to press that button and then, like, you know, this opens and I drown and die. At first. <laughs> We're gonna fix this, the stanchion. Create a stanchion. Stanchion. Stanchion room only. <laughs> what am I doing these colors? I'm You're just making it up. look. I'm just clicking like the other one until the, it solves itself. Yes. Now what do I do? With do this? you really feel like you ever contribute more? Sometimes. All right. Sometimes I tell like funny jokes, for example. <laughs> I'm not sure that's true. It's always on the streams where you're not around. Oh, 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 gotcha. I'm just guessing that I got line all the purple stuff, but who knows for sure. Seems reasonable. Oh, it's the horrible stanchion of defeat. My feet? <laughs> yes, actually. So is it doing the thing? I think it's Did doing I stop the, thing. the leak? It's, I didn't, right? It's still leaking, I think. Yeah. So, I don't know what this machine does, but. It's fixed we created now. the soul of the habitat. I guess we're ditching Julie. We only got one suit anyway, so. <laughs> Oof, just in time. We made it to the seabed. Fantastic. Wow. There's a piece missing. I can immediately tell that there's a piece missing. That's good. Yeah, this guy. Do you see the egg right in the center? Of course I did. This one right here. We've collected every lava oh. dragon egg. I feel like I got a knife to use on a mouse. Ooh, I bet we could sharpen that. That's a pretty cool octopus. Octopi. Well, it's just one. Yeah, the singular for octopus is octopi. I have to free this <laughs> dolphin from the net somehow. <laughs> did you ever beat those 12 games? I did not. I beat six, I think. So six more to go. He's talking about Zup. Is that a gun? I got a gun. Yikes. So I stabbed the octopus. Oh, um, conch shell. Up. Yeah. Oh no. Oh yeah, okay. So I stabbed the, stabbed the octopus. And then I shoot the dolphin, right? Uh, I think you stab the octopus and then you collect the ink inside the flare. Okay. <laughs> and then what's step two of the plan? <laughs> <laughs> Look, I can only come up with the inspiration. You have to execute the vision from there. Wow, look at this piece of crap. It's like, oh, I lost a barrel. <laughs> well... You probably don't need a barrel to fire this anyway. You do. You do need a barrel to fire it. Do you really, though? You could just, like, balance the flare on this part, and then the hammer can still strike the flare, and it could still ignite it, right? I think it has to project it down to something, or else it will just explode right there. Yeah. That's, in, in your face. That's illuminating the area and accomplishing its job as a flare. What exactly are we using it for? Because I'm not sure. We you... we give it to Julie. <laughs> <laughs> I think you should still fill it with squid ink. <coughs> Did I ever beat those whole games or ten? I forgot. I think it's I think it's twelve. We're, we're not sure about the number. So we're stabbing the octopus was the plan. <laughs> Must be another way. <laughs> is it hammer time. It hammer? is definitely not hammer time. <laughs> it is inaccurate. I can't shoot the, the uh, Do we the sharpen dolphin? the knife? Why yeah, don't you do. use the knife to cut the net? 
because I'm trying to buy some time. <laughs> so that somebody else has time to make a hammer time joke? Yeah. Uh, Wait, what's this? You think it's hammer time? The game says you can't touch this gun. <laughs> <laughs> hand mirror. Find me a hand mirror. Stop. <laughs> <laughs> hammer time, yeah. We're... <laughs> Okay, no more hammer time jokes. <laughs> Find me a head mirror. <laughs> There's a mirror on the floor there. I don't yeah, know. Yeah, but that... is it a hand mirror? Let's try. Or it. is it actually a silver platter upon which you would deliver me a hand mirror? <laughs> try clicking on it just in case. The tea set is not complete. Ah. Well, I see a teapot, but I'm looking for a hand mirror. Hammers are only effective against watermelon. They're effective against a wide variety of dwarves. <laughs> they are not effective against octopuses, we have learned. Octopi. Squash. Could be effective <laughs> against that. Um, the hand mirror oh, is behind, yeah. Find me a harpoon. It's um, against the wall. Ship bell. Top hat. Yes. Sea star. Do they that's, mean a starfish? No, they clearly mean a sea star. This thing? Yes. So that's a starfish. That is a sea star. Oh, an anchor. It's hanging on the wall. Would you have said it was a sea star if I if you didn't see the word sea star first? Yeah, I tend to say starfish. Your um, I call my label. sister my sea star. So you call your sister. Was yeah. that your sister? Yes. <laughs> I, I was surprised that she allowed her likeness to be used for this film. This is the sex thing. Okay. Where is the shield? Is this a shield? No, that's a tray. It's behind the ladder there. Shell. It's in or front of the shield. incomplete uh, tea set. Okay, now we need to find a full tea set. There's a the yeah jellyfish, and then the one of the cups is hanging to the left. This cup is way too big for this tea set. Look at this. It's a proportion thing. It's like they want you to feel like it's closer to you. But like they want you to feel like you're in the I game. I can completely empty the teapot into this cup, and I'd and it wouldn't be filled all the way. It's called perspective. Try getting some. What about an old clock? I see something on the safe, and I see something right in front of the safe. <laughs> Are those all the components we need for a clock? Could be. A trucker's tea set. No, that's a gear tank for the safe. What about clock components? What is a trucker's tea set? No, oh, that's how you open the tank. <laughs> I thought I would have to like find a combination or something. Right. Just a winding thing for a clock? Nope. How do I do this? Stick it here? This is the old clock. Oh, gotcha. Because you can't, you know, you can't just have this part. Right. You need to have this thing. Old timey clock. It says that. It just said old clock. Yeah. It the, needed the word timey. I would have totally understood it. It's a clock, it so you know it's time. Or timey, uh, at least. I hate you a little bit. <laughs> Why do we need the harpoon? Is it to scare away the, the octopus? No, nothing happened. Is it hammer time yet? Uh, harpoon. Wait, what? Oh yeah, this thing. We're still missing a piece. Alright. Now what? Can I go back? Should I post a picture link of a tea set? Sure. Of a trucker's tea set? Yeah, absolutely. I want to know what a trucker's tea set is. Unless it's a picture of like how truckers go to the bathroom, in which case I don't want to see that at all. It's probably safe for work, right? Wow, that is a big... That is a juggernaut. Yeah. That is a trucker's tea set? Because that's not... That's not what it says in the URL description. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, is this guy sharp enough? Nope. What happened to our dagger? <laughs> Shit! Great, we softlocked the game. Because we didn't use the dagger on the clock when we had a chance. 
I know exactly what we need to do. Okay, I don't know what we need to do. <laughs> incorrect. Can you use it to break the barrel? Harpoon? No, the hammer. It's hammer time. Dang, you're right. It was hammer time. I know when hammer time is. Oh, we can finally use the eye. This is the eye thing. Oh, thank God. Where's the source? Is it this? I think you're gonna. The piece on the left is still missing. What piece on the left? Oh, I need a tail or something like that to stick here. What is this? Oh, a barrel. Wait, am I actually gonna shoot the the octopus? Three, four, three, two, one. It's like the barrel of a gun. Is that reference to something? I don't know what that is. The source is on Zeist, I think. I the know. source of the Trekkers tea set. It looks like it's on Think Geek. <laughs> yeah, you yeah. octopus. Oh, you hear him go like. Woo -woo. I did. I did. He's like one of the three sieges. He sounded like a woodpecker. That's what woodpeckers sound like. A little bit. Here's a mini flag in case we need one of those. <laughs> <laughs> Why wouldn't you need one of those? They they they're useful for so many things. For example. Yeah, I'll, I'll name one right now. In fact. Claiming miniature countries. <laughs> I was just gonna say that. That was one of my uses. Is that what you were gonna yeah. say? Is one of your uses yeah. for mini flags? Yeah. But of course, there are many more, right? <laughs> uses. <laughs> yes. One of which I will name immediately right now Tiny Semaphore. <laughs> <laughs> Is that what you were gonna come up with? I was gonna say something like that, yeah. Right, right. We, right. we were thinking along the same lines. Right, right obviously. Most people are thinking about tiny semaphore <laughs> a lot of the time. What am I doing? How do I get out of here? I can't do this because this screws me over. Right. So then, what are my other choices? Down here? No, that screws me too. No, um, so go up. Yeah, uh, go that one. I don't know what to do. I'm not sure yet, but you accepted these too quickly because they were already in this order and you were like, that seems great. And clearly it's not. So oh, this guy's okay. great. Okay, this go. Guy. Okay, yeah, move next one over. Yes, move that down. Yes. Yes. Yes, and then that one. Yep. We did it. Oh, so it was a horrible Highlander joke, but there can be only one of those Highlander jokes, right? <laughs> this whole time. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> Thursday streams are cancelled. We're never doing another stream on Thursday again. <laughs> Thursday streams are the best. <laughs> <That's really fun. laughs> Really fun. Nice. Nice. Kajiro has my out. back. I gotta figure out. Oh, here we go. I can't just like move the clock. I have to look back in time at the clock <laughs> to when it was moved. Right. When it wasn't there before. Right. Or even better. I don't want to hear the even better. <laughs> it's gonna be better. <laughs> Wait. Oh. What? So all I did was I used the time machine yes. to see that someone had placed the cloth there. Yes. Which now allows me yes. to move the cloth. We we didn't know we wanted to move it before. <laughs> we, we didn't know we wanted to move massive. the cloth. We were like, we have a mini flag and a massive cover. And now we've looked back in time and realized we want We might actually want to move it. We That's what we realized it. by yes. looking into the past. Yes. We we just intuitively knew with the octopus that we wanted to move that. <laughs> But with cloth that was covering there something. There can only be pun. We weren't sure. And the ladder. Wait. <laughs> oh no! Now we Hi, have Julie. Of us. Thank you. All we have to do now is restart the energy sphere. Here, take this. It might come in handy. Energy cell charger. That she was just holding down yeah. there. Well, you think you're useful? I got this. <laughs> <laughs> For which there are many uses. Yeah. You were about to name another one, uh, yeah, I think. Yeah, I mean, like, I still have one that you haven't named yet. <laughs> that's that's incredible. That's that's amazing that you... 
have another one. Yeah. So that like when we encounter that in the game, <laughs> we'll immediately recognize it. <laughs> Right? Yeah. Yeah. Well, I mean, maybe. Because I mean, it's possible that the game, the oh, use of the game is different oh, from the use that I have a, in mind. Has a completely different <laughs> use than you're thinking of? Yeah, I mean. Ah, interesting. There are a lot of uses for mini flags, so. I'm going to go back out into the ocean. Like, what if you were holding, like, an Ant Olympics? And you needed to announce the winners. <laughs> did they sh like? Did they show the flags at the, the winner? I guess the country yeah. won. They show that country yeah, flag. Yeah, and they play the um, the uh, national an an anthem, anthem. <laughs> right? Yeah. So you need mini flags for that. Is this where I use a mini flag? It is. <laughs> this is. This was the use I had in mind. Sometimes. <laughs> Sometimes this is what you were thinking. You need, yeah, yeah, you need to use a mini flag, right, to um, reveal pairs of anchors <laughs> and hide other flags underneath them, right? As as everyone knows, that seems legit. I cannot remember any of these because there's a lot of them. Do these all have different letters? M Mona ship? Mo Moan ship? Money ship. <laughs> it's good to have a firm grounding and be anchored in your puzzle. Mm. These don't even match these. No, they don't. But they match each other. Yeah, but I was what I was gonna do is like I can't memorize these because abstract geometric figures are too. Go no to the left. Mnemonical enough and for me. And the second one down, maybe. This. No, all the way to the left. This. Yeah. So what I was hoping for is if these match, I would just right. memorize the letters instead. Like this it is might, H. That might be H. <sighs> guys, just solve this for me, please. Like on the stream. Oh, wait, this guy's here, right? No, God damn it! this guy? Where the hell was he? Oh, was it this that one? one and that one? No. They're inverted. I'm just gonna click on all of them and then Everyone on the stream, please take screenshots and then just stitch them together into a revealed image and then just tell me the answers by inventing a coordinate system that's um, easy to communicate and unambiguous so that when you type in your answer, it's I not, know It's what not you memory. It's, what is it then? I don't. I think you have to click them in the in order, order of the thing. So, like. So, I have to find M? Yes. <laughs> what? What? But if it's not memory, so that's M. Yeah. If it's not now memory, now you need to find O. But it's going to close. Why, why does it show me pairs oh. when I get them wrong? Like if I do this, and then it, it doesn't mean you're wrong. Like it lets me click one more. So that implies it's memory. It's not though. Okay, let's find the O. Because we know this is M. We know this is M. So let's yes. find the O. And then if it lets us click a third map or a third flag, then we know. Or we have a strong hint, at least, that your interpretation is correct. There's O. Okay, so here's N. M, here's o, o. And then N is O. And then, and then Shit. It. So it's not... What the hell is it? We don't know what it is. A, B, C, D, E, F. I think that's supposed to be a helpful coordinate think, system. Yeah, an unambiguous coordinate system that when they post a solution, I immediately know what the answer is. D2 and C3? Oh, A, B, C... No. A, B, C, D, E, F? Okay, I see. I got his coordinate system now. A, B, C, D... So D2... And C3. A, B, C, 1, 2, 3. I do not understand your coordinate system, Kaido. I think he sunk our battleship. B2... Is this B2? Yes. A, B, C, one, two, three. Unless he's kind of from the bottom. Oh, we've got one. We got one. <laughs> but there's nothing that matches with that circle, yellow circle with the black square. Wait, it let me do three. What the hell is going on? 
I don't know. Like, if you look in this, um, so look at the uh, e, uh, A, B, C, D, E, 2. Oops, that's one of the two, sorry. Okay, E, 2. Oh, F, 2, sorry. F, 2. F, 2. F, 2. Oh. That's F, 1. F. So <laughs> there's nothing that matches that, as far as I can tell. See if you can find another Clearly one that you matches missed that. This one, right over. Right, right over. This is why I determined that it wasn't memory, is that there wasn't any one that matched. That's so distinctive that I was like. But what about the part where it lets us look at three of them at the same time? This is what I'm saying, like, it's not memory. But one of them was memory. Like, we did find two matching guys. I. Well. This is like a hybrid memory slash <laughs> sequence finder. Or, or what the hell is this puzzle? Maybe we're supposed to make words? But some of these don't even show up here, so we, there's no interpretation of our letters. Oh. We got another pair. Okay, let's let's be met methodological. <laughs> Yellow plus on red. Blue X. I feel like we've seen those somewhere. Here, this guy and this guy. I don't understand. So, so far it's been memory. Like, every time we remove something, it's been memory. Okay, fine. Oh, okay, wait, 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 we got there, this. That. Yeah, and then... Oh, wait. Okay, yeah. But then you said you know the where this is, or...? Yes. Uh, up, no, up that one, right there. Okay. Wait. What? <laughs> like, I did one, and then it's like, no, you're wrong, and, and canceled it. It did, yeah. I think this game, maybe this game is just buggy. I don't know what happened. <laughs> it is a hybrid puzzle. Right? It's it's saying now these, like, put this on S or whatever. I hate this puzzle. <laughs> What's this? Like? Okay, whatever. Find the pairs. Mini then, flags are dumb. <laughs> and then of the things that aren't pairs. What is this? A harpoon gun holster? Match them with the thing. It's not buggy. Clearly, it's a shopping cart. I don't get it. A buggy is like another... I thought a buggy is like a... Like, like a, a dune buggy? Yeah. It's not. It's a tiny little ant for your ant Olympics. What the buggy. hell did I just do? You stopped the leak. How? By closing Smashing. down a gate over the... This is a sunken ship and there's holes all over it. And it's stopping the water from... Yeah. I gotta see this for myself because I don't believe it. Show. Oh god, it is, that is exactly what happened. <sighs> what is this thing? Use a harpoon to plug a leak. Seems ant ethical. <laughs> it's a it's a buggy joke. It's a it's a little joke about bugs. <laughs> A USB charger. What is this? Oh, that's the key for the chest. Alright. I keep trying to go down the stairs by going here. Yeah, that's silly. Why would anyone think that that would be the way you go down the stairs? Good thing there was that puzzle that makes us backtrack there. <laughs> Great energizer. 21.1 gigawatts. Now we're back on the surface for no reason. No explanation how. Oh, do you remember when we were there for a minute? Yeah. You didn't just save me, but the Buried Kingdom as well. You're a true friend. <laughs> I was only trying to save the Buried Kingdom. I've always wanted to discover this place. 
I'm going to stay here for a while and examine this habitat. Take care. I know we'll meet again. Why? Why is she assuming that I'm letting her keep the dragon? I think she knows that you don't really like dragons. <laughs> Is that us? Yeah, I think so. Us singular. The royal us. <laughs> Thanks for the um, life preserver, <laughs> drunk and cellar dude. <laughs> <laughs> I think we still only got 30 out of the 20, 13 out of yeah. the 20 hidden objects. Speed through these credits. Did you love that game? It was. The fifth game in the series. <laughs> <laughs> that is very true. That is very true. It was the fifth game, which I believe is the last game in the series. Yes. Well, we can no, order. No, we can order Secret, Secret Order, order 7. Seven. We haven't done. That means there's a Secret Order Six somewhere yeah. that we haven't done. Yep, yeah, that is what that means. We did this one. Yes. Oh yeah, Miss Ravenwood. Yes. I assume we did not get 100%. Gee, we got 90, but that's not too bad. It's not terrible, but it's not amazing. Okay. So. <laughs> Thank you, everyone, for tuning in. I uh, hope to see you guys next time. No, every Thursday. Every Thursday. Because uh, Stephanie is going to be here with me. That's when the, the good stream is. Non Thursdays are the less good streams where it's only <laughs> right, me streaming. Right. Um, so yeah, so thanks for tuning in. Hope you guys enjoyed this stream, and I'll catch you guys next time. <laughs>